Hello everyone, this is Logan, and today I'm going to show you how to overclock a ATI Radeon HD 5830 to the maximum of 900 MHz. Now, first of all, I apologize for the very warm color on the video. It fraps records my flux for some reason which makes it, makes it come out really warm but believe me it's not that bad on my screen anyway today I'm going to be using MSI Afterburner to overclock my graphics card so this is open now up I've never attempted to record on my desktop before so I don't know how slow or you know laggy it's going to be Apparently I'm only getting like 19 FPS on my desktop at the moment, which I don't know why. But, well, anyway, so here is the clock speed. The default for the core clock is 800 megahertz, so you'd be safe to overclock that to 900. The core voltage is locked for some reason. So is the shader clock that is also locked on this card. The memory clock I put to 1300, which is maximum. And the fan speed is set to manual at 67 megahertz, uh, 67 percent. Sorry. And um, during gaming, I have had a maximum of it on this card of 100 degrees Celsius. That's probably because of my well, quite shoddy case. Well. It's not that case, I suppose it's a NZXT Phantom in red. Unfortunately my case has no intake fans which probably would help, but I do have one 120mm fan on top for exhausting which is a nice blue LED fan. I have one on my PSU which is just a normal PSU fan, and two what looks to be 40mm fans on the side which again are exhaust fans so I have no idea why my cooling on my case is so you know crap but it is anyway that's basically well getting back to this you basically drag and drop these um, sliders to your hands content you could underclock this card but I don't see why you'd want to do that and in comparison though, between this car being at standard 800 MHz and 900 MHz, I get about a 15 FPS increase on Grand Theft Auto 4 and about 10 FPS increase on Mafia 2. I can't really show you a benchmark because I do not have any screenshots of that so that will be another Lord Logan video